負けに行くそいつは負け犬じゃねえ明日は俺のライバルだ今こいつを倒す何なんだその振り回るのは5枚目悪魔を捨てる Guys, welcome back to my reaction channel. Today we're going to react to Black Clover episode 107. Now, guys, the Black Bulls are on their way to the capital to help Finral and Yami. Like I said, they got some hitchhikers along the way, right? The zombie dude, the guy with the spatial magic, and the girl that wants to experiment on everybody. They kind of converted them to the good side, and now they all are gonna go over there appear out of nowhere and start beating the shit out of elves, bro. So I'm here for it, definitely. But I, like I said, I want the vice captain of the Black Bulls to get over here if he exists and to pop out of nowhere and help us because we can really use the help. That being said, if you enjoy my reactions, you know what to do. Let's go, man. Share, subscribe, like, leave a comment, you know. Join the Patreon, support your boy, Discord. And Am I going insane? Because I don't understand. Apparently, your son, who engaged in violent behavior during my royal knight selection exam, is now under suspicion of treason? But even if it is a rumor, I can't let my bloodline mix with a man of such ill repute! Great uncle. Oh my god. So yeah, they said it. She's supposed to marry Longris, and she's pretty much royalty, maybe not next in line, but still. So my man actually trying to cancel the wedding? I know Lord Longris and don't have any misgivings about him. Please don't judge him too harshly. It's a development regarding the mage attacks. Don't okay. bother! I'm sure the Magic Knights have already gathered in the capital! Until I get there, they can do whatever they want for all I care! Place under control. Do you not see that they're all glowing, bro? Like, is it just me? Do you not see that they all have red, weird tattoos across their face and glowing, bro? You live in a world of magic and you don't find this suspicious? This is not suspicious to you? Your group should hurry and help the townspeople. Actually, we have some business with the humans on the other side of that door. Clearing the way. That's treason! We'll stop you! You can't touch him, bro. Now, compass magic! Willful compass! And he's not even alone. Yo, this is like the royal guard. So Longris did- That was like the royal guard of uh, the Midnight Sun, right? Because Vangis' group he spent a lot of time assembling the strongest of the strongest, and they're all here. Ahead with Longris. They're breaking in. But it's a good thing that Yami and Finnegal just arrived, and Asta and the others are about to pop out of nowhere as well, so we're gonna have some strong backup. Make that hole in the castle gate! Uh, ooh, ooh, ooh. So Sorry, Longris I was talking. did make that hole in the castle Longris. gate! Honestly, I'm not too worried about helping the royals out. But this key... <laughs> Judging by that, some pretty tough contenders have weaseled their way into the castle. Two of us against dozens of them. It doesn't look good. They're not trying to kill us? You're awfully naive. Oh no, I fully intend to kill you. And by <laughs> you, I mean the freeloader who took control of that body. Pretty entertaining! Kick yeah, yeah. You're A exactly captain. the ones I want to slice up! So thanks for coming out. Perfect! It's Jack the Ripper, Captain of the Green Brain Mantises, an all-around psychopath! <laughs> an all-around psychopath, and I think he's also a commoner, just like Yami, so they don't like the royals, bro. I, they, Ray, I love it. And Yami and him are low-key rivals, so this, this is gonna be great. Grief. It's nice to have reinforcements, but did it have to be this guy? Hey, he blocked Those it. Those weak blades can't cut through my armor! Die! My yeah, man said, yeah. die. <laughs> I was about to say that, bro. They're both captains. They're struggling against these fodder characters, bro. What are they gonna do against Char and the other captain level threats? Hey, Jack. What's the next idea in that sick old head of yours? <laughs> Dark cloak light with one strike. Ooh. <laughs> That's a big mistake. Finral! Yes, sir! Spatial magic! Fallen Angel Gate! He saved- Yo, Finral! Oh, no. He's clutch! Come on, let me borrow him sometime! No way, get your own door guy! This is super <laughs> fun and all, but we should get going! Uh, door guy is crazy! Look over there! <clears throat> K 
care, care. You there, lowly servant, stand still. Commoners like you only exist for our benefit. Now act as my shield. Damn, he deserved that. Hiding yourself won't work. You really lost to Noel? That's pathetic, Solid. It sounds like you let your guard down for a moment. <laughs> it wasn't a moment. She Noelle overpowered him. Of anything that I suddenly feel uneasy. Here we go. You're being attacked. A knight from the Golden Dawn? I've come to dispose of you. That. Her power is incredible. Bloodline. Oh my goodness, you don't have So what 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 is she talking about? That tainted bloodline. They don't like the like they don't like nobles, but they hate despise royals. So the royal bloodline goes way back to maybe the first wizard king or some shiz. And they think he killed the elves. Like I, I don't know, bro, but it they really have a grudge against royalty. Have any manners at all? Let us teach you. Miss Magic Song, Miss Clones! Can I have a bit of fun? Ooh. She will never Am miss. I? How? The clones did nothing to distract her. She located me effortlessly. Oh. Yeah, because she's not aiming with her eyes. She's aiming with her magic. She just said it a minute ago. It will never miss her target, right? Her attack. Nah, that's crazy. She got pierced through and through. This girl's dead. Human techniques are so underhanded. Oh, I wonder what's inside the big mystery ball. <laughs> Whatever it is, I'm ready to liven things up. Filled with even more people who want to kill us because that's the kind of day it's been! Yeah, but that's exciting for him, so you just hyped him up. <laughs> like, you didn't say anything that's gonna make him, th that's gonna dissuade him from going in there, bruh. My man just got even more hyped. You crazy, bruh. Funeral, you should have kept your mouth shut. But I am glad that uh, this captain is here to help Yami because they work well together, even though they, they are constantly bickering. But he's, he's strong, man. Well, that's great. Who the hell thought it'd be a good idea to invite the giant floating boulder to the party? Only for you when I wasn't- I wouldn't be worried about you if you were missing for a hundred years! You're so Bruh. wimpy! Hey. And I hope you enjoyed your nap while the rest of us were nap. trying to save I'm the kingdom! So bruh, don't be so rude! My man was Swiss cheese, bruh! I'm surprised he survived! That is crazy! She's rude as hell for that! <laughs> but yeah, Asta's gonna pop out of nowhere right now as well, bruh! I'm here for it! Idiot! It's been a while, hasn't it, Captain Crazy? Captain I decided crazy. I would join, since you seem to be having so much trouble keeping it together. What was your name again? I was he knows. getting tired of waiting. You better make up for wasting time. No, I love how Yami believes in every member of his squad. He knows exactly who that is. He's just trolling him low-key, right? But he's so glad that he finally made up his damn mind. But I love it. I love Where it. Where have you been, Mr. Silver Eagles? Did you get held up at a hair appointment or something? Your house is a mess, so you might want to go take care of that. Who the hell died and made you, boss? Oh, shut up. <laughs> None of you <laughs> idiots is allowed to get killed. You're the last person I needed to hear that from. Hey. So I'm going to do what I want. Considering how many we're up against, we gotta move smart. Hey, mm. wait! Nobody said you could do that! Just let him go. He doesn't take orders from you. He doesn't care about your royal status. Zora can actually low-key understand the elves, because he also does like he also despises royals, bruh. They killed his dad brutally. Right? But he's also very analytical and smart. He said, we need to approach this in a smart way. That's why he went away on his own. He was selected to become one of the royal knights, so I'm sure he has his own fighting style. With fine mana control, he can make free transforming mercury magic work for attack and defense at the same time. Hey. He really is talented. The magic coming off of those compasses is blocking me from landing a hit. What do I do? This can't be happening. You're about to die. That does not help you. Oh, Nozelle. She's gonna deflect it. Not even the spell Noel used to defeat me could break through that mana. Bewildering forest of mist. All of you will die here. Compass magic. Another Atlas. She can control hers. My spells will hit you without fail. 
Damn, cause they never miss. Stay there, solid. Let's show her our power, Noel. The house Silva stands strong. Yo. Yo, 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 I think he's actually, yo, this got me emotional. He's actually recognizing Noelle's efforts and her progression, and I think he ranks her now above the other two siblings. So he's showing her respect. He is allowing her to show him what she's capable of. He's like, stand tall next to me. We got this, right? We're gonna protect the weaker f siblings, right? Nah, 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 this is actually dope. This is actually dope, man. And yeah, Noelle... She's struggling, but she has mana skin on, so maybe this new technique from the elf ain't gonna affect her that much, right? Because remember, her problem was control, and now in this sphere, they can't control shit, right? So that's kind of the... right? So I think Noelle might be able to navigate this terrain, even though Nozelle might be having some trouble, but very interesting, very interesting magic, compass magic and shit, right? Very, very interesting. Nozelle got hit, he got nicked, right? Because, yeah, it's a very powerful combination. She disrupts your magical ability, but her magic never never misses her target. So she can still control her offensive abilities. So, yo, I kind of love it. I'm not going to lie. I kind of love it. So this is going to be definitely interesting. I love how we all separated, right? Yami, Finral, and Captain Jack, right? They're, they're going to protect the king. Because they know the Wizard King ain't around anymore to do so. And the king takes priority, and Nozel is here to protect his family, bro, his royal family, right? And, and the others are probably gonna raid House Vermilion, they're gonna protect them, and yeah, we're all over the place. But Longris, who's gonna fight Longris, bro? Because that kid does not care, right? And I think he's gonna be Yami, and yeah, this is not gonna be easy. Definitely not gonna be easy, because, bro, the captains are struggling against, like, mages that weren't even captain level. They were just basic magic knights, and yet... And yet, in Elvish form, they're broken. They're broken. I'm just waiting for Asa to appear out of nowhere, bro. Uh, he should have already been here since they have, right, a, a spatial magic user now. Right, but but I guess maybe they're taking the longer route. And, and Yuno's also somewhere out there fighting a meaningless battle. He should come here too, man. We, we need to regroup. We need to regroup. That being said, I really enjoyed this episode. Hope you enjoyed the reaction. And I'll see you in the next one. Stay safe. Love you. Enjoy and bye.